watching thank you so much for being here please don't forget to subscribe to the channel like the videos and share them today i am going to share with you guys how i make my very spicy and citrusy fish recipe this you can make with any fish you have tilapia red snapper the list goes on today i'm using parrot fish parrot fish in my opinion is so pretty i just like to look at it So oh, my fishes are already cleaned and I made incisions on them so you can make any type of incisions uh, on your fish you like and uh, the first thing I'm gonna do is just season it with salt and lemon juice that's the basis of seasoning any fish lemon salt so I'm gonna set it aside for a few minutes whilst I get the carne sauce the spicy sauce ready for the spicy sauce i have my carne sauce i promised to upload that video weeks ago uh, still didn't get to it but i will and use any spicy sauce you have and i added some butter to it with dijon mustard put any mustard you have and i'm gonna add one jimbo to it and I'm also gonna add black pepper to it. At this point, if you want, you can add garlic, but if you don't have the, if you don't wanna add the garlic or you don't have it, you can just stuff the fish with uh, the garlic instead of putting it here. So I opted to just put it um, inside the fish instead of in this mixture the mixture is smelling so so good it is so good so the goal here is to rub this delicious mixture all over the fish from the belly to the head we want the spicy mixture everywhere everywhere so be very generous when you do this um that's what i'm doing here open the belly make so the spicy uh, mixture is everywhere so after putting all the mixtures in you're gonna see i'm gonna stuff my um my faces with some vegetables you if you have uh potatoes put potatoes in there you want it even more spice, spicier than this put habanero peppers uh, slice them and put them in there it's limitless whatever you like to enjoy just put it inside there So it's been a little bit past 30 minutes so these are the veggies and the lemon i have over there that i'm gonna put inside the fish so um it's limitless what you can put in there whatever herbs and vegetables you enjoy potatoes put it in there uh you like cilantro put a few pieces in there rosemary chive put it in there um, you'll be amazed uh, the flavor that you're gonna get just it's gonna infuse the fish so um, I'm gonna go ahead now and just stuff my fishes with the available veggies that I have put some garlic cloves in there and some lemon wedges inside the belly So I put some wedges of um, my lemon in the incisions that I made. The goal here is to grill it with it. So every part of the fish is infused with the citrus. Oh my God, this 
it's gonna be amazing please try this recipe you will not regret it at all um the inside is gonna be so juicy the outside is gonna be so crispy um please try this recipe as always let me know what you think and i'm just sprinkling some garlic half seasoning on top of it this is really optional this portion but um i just have it available decided to sprinkle some on top If you have some veggies like onions or bell peppers or any vegetables you have you can make a vegetable bed then put your fish on top of it that's amazing too but today I just want to grill it without any vegetable bed so I'm gonna go ahead and pop this in my air fryer instead of the oven today and um, it takes less than 15 minutes to have a perfectly grilled fish um, it's just amazing i love 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 my air fryer this side of the fish is done cooking after seven minutes so i'm gonna go ahead and flip it then add more of the spicy mixture the carny mixture and place more uh, lemon wedges and pop it back in the air fryer You can pair this with anything you like, salad, potato salad, mashed potatoes, anything you like basically. But today I'm going to just pair it with potato salad. Very simple and straightforward. If you want, I can make a recipe of this, but um, I'm just going to run through it quickly. Just potatoes and little spices and some eggs but there is a trick to getting a really creamy uh, potato salad it's not the mayonnaise there is a trick to it so next time i can share that with you now we are all done the fishes are looking so crispy on the outside i can smell the citrus and inside believe me it is juicy i just laid it down uh, on the plate with just few leaves of lettuce and cilantro so i'm gonna enjoy it with that side of potato salad it is so spicy juicy and crispy on the outside this fish recipe will really leave you wanting more so please try this recipe let me know what you think and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and share the videos and i will see you in the next video have an amazing day bye